In today's video, we're going to talk about the three main things you need to be aware of when dealing with a woman. Number one, you never break eye contact with a woman. We already talked about that they can read you much faster than you. So what you do is you keep eye contact at all times when you're talking to them. There are some videos out there that talk about 80% and all that. It's just rubbish. Think about it. So you're having a 100 minute conversation with someone and after 80 minutes, you stop looking at them. It's stupid. So you keep an eye contact with people when you're talking to them. It shows signs of confidence, especially when you're talking to a woman. If you break eye contact with a woman, you are showing three things. Either you are not confident in yourself, you are anxious, you are showing signs of anxiety, or you are being deceptive, or you are just plain not interested. So always keep an eye contact when you're talking to a woman. It shows signs of confidence and she will start lowering her defenses and open up for more conversation. The second one is grooming. Grooming shows signs of confidence. Even if you like your life is not working out well, you're making a conscious decision when you are waking up, taking care of yourself. So you are saying to the world, fuck you. I'm going to take care of myself, I love myself, I believe in myself, even if my life is not working out well, at least there are some things under my control. And when you do that, people will feel that, especially women, because like I said, you need to keep this in the back of your mind when you're communicating with a woman. They can read you. Think about it. Women spend an enormous amount of time and money in the, in the cosmetics things, like the makeup and eyelashes and all that stuff like billions a year, it's an enormous industry. And especially because they are much better at body language, they will notice it. And when you are talking to her, she will feel that it's another sign of confidence and she will start opening up because she sees that you are confident in yourself. The third one is what I call front to front. When you are communicating with a person, if it's a man, you need to stand on the side. Unless it's like a board meeting or something where you have like fixed seats. But in normal situations, when you are like communicating with someone like face to face, with a man, you never stand in front of them. It provokes bad tension because men are just different. So when it's a man, you rotate to the side. But if it's a woman, you need to stay at arm's length when you're communicating with them. If it's more than that, they will perceive that as lack of trust. And if it's less than that, and what I mean by less is like being much closer than one arm's length, you're actually invading the space. So now that's a problem as well. So keep your distance at one arm's length and you'll be good to go.